Welcome to a vision of Japan, unlike anything you've experienced before. Sekiro, Shadows Die Twice, is set during the closing years of the Sengoku period. It's a time of near endless conflict and bloodshed. Journey into this unforgiving world shaped by violence and discover what secrets await in the shadows. Sekiro, Shadows Die Twice, follows the story of a shinobi known as the Wolf. As a young boy roaming the battlefield, he's taken in by the owl. What's the matter, Stray? Nothing left to lose. The Wolf is assigned to protect a new master known as the Divine Heir. You will pledge your life in my service. As you command. The boy is the descendant of a mysterious bloodline making him the target of the Ashina clan. Leave this to me, so the noble shinobi stands in our way. You must never forget the shinobi code. If your master is taken, bring him back at any cost. What is this? The wolf's prosthetic arm changes how he fights. This mysterious shinobi tool can be outfitted with an arsenal of powerful items, like the grappling hook. Use it to explore new areas or gain a tactical advantage. Break shields with the loaded ax. Drag enemies closer with the loaded spear or set them ablaze with the flame vent. Stun and confuse enemies with shuriken and firecrackers or deflect heavy attacks with the loaded umbrella. Mix these powerful tools with your sword to find new ways to kill ingeniously and tip the odds of the fight your way. Combat in Sekiro Shadows Die Twice requires strategy, and the same tactics won't work against every enemy. A master shinobi must be both aggressive and versatile. Deflection is just one way to turn an enemy's attacks into an opportunity. Each deflection will deal damage to an enemy's posture. Keep it up, and the enemy's posture will break, leaving them vulnerable. Use this critical moment to land serious damage with a shinobi death blow. Enemies at times will use perilous attacks that cannot be blocked. In these situations, you'll need to make a split-second decision. Will you risk great harm to yourself and attempt to counter the attack? Or will you use this moment to fall back and prepare for your next move? Success against stronger enemies will come down to learning their distinct tactics and responding with your own unique offensive and defensive maneuvers. You'll also find that certain situations allow for a silent approach. Use your blade for a quiet takedown. Or eavesdrop to gain vital information about your enemies. In Sekiro, shadows die twice. You won't survive every encounter, but death is not always defeat. The wolf has his limited ability to return from the dead using resurrection. After resurrecting, the wolf is vulnerable. If he's killed, it will mean losing valuable resources and potentially other, more personal consequences. Performing a shinobi death blow or resting at a sculptor's idol will allow the wolf to resurrect once again. With each battle won, you'll begin to unlock new skills that help you fight and defend. You'll discover shinobi tools that expand the capabilities of your prosthetic arm and find materials like gunpowder to upgrade them. Your journey into darkness will be fraught with challenge and surrounded by death. But if you execute different strategies in battle and leverage the powerful tools in your arsenal, you can rise to any challenge.